Hello friends, uh, in this video I will show you how to do quickly setting outs. Uh, often in our design we have to produce sheets with the setting or showing the levels uh, at 10, 10 meter interval or something and we need to manually click every 10, 10 meter or something. So I will show you how we can do that quickly. In alignment, we have one option there. So let's find out that option. Uh, I select the alignment and go to edit level properties. Now here I can add major change and create one style. So I select this style and I will edit. I will copy and edit that and I call it style a label. Then in the layout, if you see here a drop down and you have one reference text. In the reference text you can create a select either profile or surface. I mean you can select your proposed profile level or your proposed surface level. I'm going with the proposed profile and you can see here one is created. Then I go to enter inside and here in drop down you can see you get the profile options. So I select before elevations and I add that and hit OK. You can modify how you want to show and display those. So I'm going with the text size 2.5%. I'm going to rotate it with the 90. Then the X offset 5, Y offset 5, or 2.5 and 2.5. And you can delete anything else in the styles. Also, you can enter any block in the file uh, just to show where exactly that elevation is. So I'm going to select this and let's see which block do I have any good block? Okay, uh, AC tick and circle. You can select any block you like and you can change the size of block here 1.5. So, yes, my style is created. I hit enter, enter, and create. Also, you can select whether you want to give in 10 meter, 20 meter, 30 meter. So I will give it 10 meter and hit apply and OK. So here it comes. Now you have to select this point and you have to assign which profile you want to project the labels. So here you can, if you select this here in the uh, property it will ask you to select your proposed profile so you have to select your proposed profile and here you can see the all levels are come down at 10 10 meter interval the amazing part of this is that it's very dynamic if you change your profile level it will automatically update so anytime you want some profile level to check you can do this with very quickly if I go and change my profile my level has also been updated quickly so I'm changing this and it's updating corridor and profile and every level you can see the levels has changed so it's very dynamic same way you can create alignment on the your age line and you can select how 10, 10 or 15 meter interval you want to show the levels. Also you can, another method you can do it, show the alignment and you can create one more style from here also. An alignment station offset fixer. You can do like copy any styles. I'm going to clear Sanda, copy this. And same procedure you can do, go in the layout, add your reference text, and select profile, delete everything else on the styles, label, and select profile elevation, enter, and OK, and OK. So, here also you can do, you select your alignment and you select the point and it will ask you, prompt you to select the profile and you can give the levels.
then it's very dynamic wherever you want to. You can see how it's changing with the alignments. So in this way you can do the setting out or you can uh, check your tie-in levels on the profile or you can check the uh, center line level of your alignment on the profile. Thank you. Thank you for watching this.